people always ask me how my knee is doing now that I'm back from injury, and I think it's really good. I think I'm stronger than I was before um, physically, um, and then I've had some, a chance to grow also as a person. And I'm in grad school now. I've just had so many more opportunities that have opened up, and I've really been focusing on on all the silver linings um, and just counting my blessings that I'm able to come back and play and, and have this fifth year um, with Kevin and with the rest of the seniors, me, Ray, and Kyle. Sitting on the bench for a year was, was really tough for me, um, but I definitely think that I learned a lot um, doing that and experiencing that. I think I had the chance to grow as more of a leader, um, take on more of a vocal role and help some of the younger guys um, with some of the stuff they do on and off the court. Um, and especially the bigs, I had the chance to work with them a lot as sort of a big coach. Um, and I think that really helped me and helped help me grow and mature more. Um, and that extra year definitely was a lot, was very important to me. Um, and I think you really see what adversity can do to a team. And I think now that we've gone through that, we're much more prepared this year um, for when, when adversity comes, because it's going to come. Um, and so I think we're really prepared for that. And we have so much more experience this year um, across the board with our seniors with our underclassmen, and I think uh, we're just all really ready to go. I'm most excited for the first game. Um, I mean, coming off an injury, you, you look forward to milestones, um, being able to walk first, and being able to run, and being cleared for full contact, and then right after that is the first game, and something I've been waiting for for over a year, and it's felt like forever, um, but it's finally here. I think we have a great group of guys um, on and off the court. We really enjoy playing with each other and, and being with each other. Um, we, we've been having a lot of fun on the court, bringing lots of energy, being positive, encouraging each other, challenging each other, um, and then that translates off the court. We hang out a lot, playing video games, hanging out at the house, um, whatever functions we're doing. Um, we have a lot of fun together. I think we have great chemistry, and, and, I, and I love that about our team. We were just at WCC Media Day the other day, and um, it just struck me how strong the conference is going to be this year. Um, we have nine teams, and from top to bottom, anyone can beat anyone on, every, on any given day. Um, and I think especially the top five are going to be, are going to be really uh, competitive. Um, I think each team has a bunch of strong, strong players, good co great coaches, um, and it's going to be really interesting to see what happens this year. Obviously, we're expecting um, to be on top of the conference and really and really come back and have a really strong year. And I think that's something that is going to be tough to do, but I think something that we are ready to do. Um, and, and we're all really excited to be that team and, and come back and respond to, uh, to the season we had last year. When faced with adversity, I think there's, there's really only two ways. You either, you either respond to it or you sort of just let it happen. And I think in the past, we haven't done the best job and, and we've let it happen to us and we've let other things affect what we do. And I think from now on, we just have to let, to play our game and not let that other stuff affect us. And when, when the stuff does come, when adversity comes, when challenges hit us, I think we just need to stay focused and stay within our group and really reinforce each other, encourage each other, support each other more than ever and not worry about what other people are saying, what other people are doing and really just focus on playing our game, sticking to the game plan and doing whatever it takes to uh, overcome it. Yeah, going to grad school is a lot of fun. Um, I mean, I feel old now seeing seeing the uh, the younger people on campus, 17, 18, and I'm 22. Um, it's weird. I mean, being here for five years is a huge part of my life, um, core of my life, and it's been awesome. And I'm I'm actually really happy that I get another year to come come back and stay on this campus with with uh, with my fellow teammates and my and my peers. And I, grad school so far is going great. It's not it's not too hard. Um, I mean, it's a pretty heavy workload, but I'm able to, to balance both, and, and I've been enjoying my classes, and so it's going great. I think in the past year, I've had the opportunity to work on some small things um, that have really helped me in my game. I think definitely ball handling and just my skills and being able to handle the ball better, not turn it over, um, to really be more versatile so I can play outside and inside. And then working on my strength a lot. I put on a lot of weight um, in the last year, and some of it's come off since uh, so I've been doing a little more running lately. Um, but yeah, I think working on my body, staying healthy, and then also my perimeter game um, is something that will really help me this year.